This is the Business of Leadership Series Minute with your host, the best-selling author of Don't Buy a Duck and founder of MarketingStrategyHero.com, Derek Champagne. Today we are talking with Evan Delahanty. He is uh, the owner of Peaceful Fruits. You may have seen him on the TV show Shark Tank. He's making big waves right now with his product, Peaceful Fruits. Evan, welcome to the show today. Thank you so much, Derek. I'm happy to be here. Take me back to, you were in the Peace Corps, you had this idea. Many people have ideas, but not everybody acts on it. And you did it in a big way. What was your mindset? Did you have an, a, a business background? Did you have an entrepreneurial experience? What fueled you to actually take action? Yeah, well, for me, um, I, you know, I, I was a little bit different from your average Peace Corps volunteer because I went in, you know, uh, still early in my career, but after four years in operations management of a, of a private company um, that does uh, industrial supply. So, you know, very salt of the earth, you know, boring by some, by some method measures, but, uh, you know, I got real world management and project management experience um, in the business sector. And then I took that and went to the Peace Corps. Um, and so what I was doing in Peace Corps was all around uh, you know, organizing project management and a lot of small business and entrepreneurial uh, support for the folks down there in the Amazon. Um, and honestly, what happened is uh, I got a job offer coming out of Peace Corps for the picture perfect job for, for me, for Evan, which was, uh, you know, being involved with a green energy organization, a solar energy company in, in Africa to help them build a division and, you know, really scale it from nothing to something where, you know, if you were successful as as growing that division, you'd grow into being the number two or number three guy at the company. Um, and I ended up saying no to that because I just wasn't ready to move from Suriname straight to uh, West Africa. Um, you know, I was ready to come home and, you know, reconnect with my family and my community and my, you know, my country. Um, but, you know, if I, if I felt like if I'm going to say no to the picture perfect job opportunity, and I've been, you know, preaching, if you will, teaching entrepreneurship and small business management and all that for the last couple of years, like kind of on me to build something better if I'm going to say no to something that perfect. And so that's where I decided it's time to get off the pot, so to speak, and uh, and really build something. And Peaceful Fruits was was what I saw in my network, in the market, you know, in my in the connections that I built in, in Peace Corps that I felt like I could go out there and, and do in a sustainable way that would address development needs but also address market needs because you know everybody likes fruit snacks but people don't tolerate the junk that's in there anymore now they're reading labels and they care about what's behind the product so there seemed like an opportunity Derek Champagne here I want to connect with you if you're listening to the business leadership series we can connect on LinkedIn or send me a message at Derek at DerekChampagne.com I look forward to connecting